Happy Friday, my friends. We're doing a cut test with the minuscule Mini Corvid from Concept. Um, I bought this kind of on a whim. Um, I really like tiny knives. I've got a little bit of a collection going. And this is just a really cool tiny knife. Um, my buddy Rochambeau convinced me. He sent, he sent me a video of him... Uh, really easily flicking this thing, like reverse flicking it, front flipping it, and I was like, damn, that's kind of uh, unique for a tiny knife, be, you know, being able to deploy it that easily. So I picked one up, and uh, it's fun. It's not super practical, um, but it's just very small and really fun to fidget with. And look how it's slicing. Dude. Holy shit. You just gotta make sure, you know, you don't... Uh, there's very little actual edge, so... It's easy for the cardboard to slip into the sharpening choil or just out of your cut entirely. But if you keep it within that, like, you know, little over an inch of edge, this thing slices. Actually slices pretty good. How much edge is there? I got my tape measure right here. Let's see. There's about an inch and a quarter of cutting edge. So, yeah, actually, if this is all you have and you need to break down some cardboard, you'll be fine. Utility cuts. This is a cleaver-style blade, so this should be uh, real easy for it. Pinch grip feels the best uh, on this knife, you know. Um, gripping it like a regular knife, you can only get two fingers on it. But a pinch grip feels good. There's even a little divot kind of on the spine for you to put your... Uh, pointer finger kind of rest your uh, your pointer finger in and it's comfy it's doing well with these utility cuts the blade steel is uh, 154 cm a little bit of turns in there one spot where it didn't cut all the way through but not bad since it's so small it's hard to generate enough pressure into your cut. There's just not enough to grab onto. Let's try this tubing. As expected, not very easy to cut through this thick of tubing with a, you know, with this tiny little guy, but it's, it's doable. The sharpening trial on this thing is really nice too there are titanium versions of the knife which I almost kind of wish that I had gotten um, and I still might uh, the the thought of this tiny little guy in full titanium really is kind of uh, tempting to me let's try the Cecil rope little uh, sawing motions needed here it's basically like a, a razor blade with a tiny little handle but you know a little bit of sawing and you're through it not bad not bad at all This knife is really uh, just a, a package opener, you know. Small utility cuts and package opening is going to be uh, primarily what people use this for. And I think for that, it's going to do really good. Now, for the leather glove, we're just going to cut off a single finger and, uh, and do it on that instead of the whole glove like we usually do. Just fine. What's next? Believe it or not, we are gonna attempt the strap. <laughs> Let's see how many times it takes me to get through this. Two inch heavy duty strap. One. Two. 
two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, one more, it's gonna be nine, nine, up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, ten, damn it, ten, we did it. So, if you have some time, and this is the only knife you have, you can get through some really uh, heavy duty strap material. I think this would be a good candidate for a, a lanyard. Uh, I think it would even help your grip. Um, plus, make it easier to find and pull out of your pocket. There's no clip on this guy, which uh, makes sense. I don't think it needs a clip or should have a clip. I'm trying to stick this in the wood. But since it doesn't really have a tip... Um, oh, there we go. Nailed it! This is one of the least threatening knives I've ever seen, I think. Um, not only is it tiny, but there's no point. So there's really, you're not gonna be stabbing with this thing at all. Um, it's just really not dangerous, you know? This would be even probably a good knife to give to your kid, your little kid to start teaching knife safety with, you know? Um, yeah, it's still dangerous, but not as dangerous as a, you know, a tiny, very pointy knife, which there are a lot of those out there. Um, this is just really non-threatening, non-intrusive. Um, if you have like an office job where you don't want to bust out your big knife and, and scare the, the little, little old ladies, then this could be a good option. Or if you're someone like me and you just like fidgeting with the tiny little knife, then, then there you go. That's, it's for you too. Um, I really like it. I might get the full titanium version. I'm still thinking about it. I probably will, to be honest with you. Um, it's just, uh, it'll go good with my little McB, you know. So that's it. Please like the video. I'll see you soon. Adios.